channel. If you're new, welcome. My name is Darlene. Today I'm going to be reviewing this right here. It is a gym storage rack. So let's go ahead and open this up and start getting it all set up. So I'm going to go ahead and take all the pieces out of here um, so that it'll be easier for me to put it together. And then I'm going to show you guys how to set this thing up. Okay. So for step one, you want to make sure that this is facing upwards and then you're going to get these two sides like this and you're going to grab there's holes on the side and then there's holes right there so you're going to grab this and you're going to screw this into here on both sides okay and then I'm going to do the same thing to this other side, but on that side, we're going to be adding this basket. And you can see it has these two holes right here. So we're going to make sure that the bars are facing the same way. This little curve up top is matching the other side. And then we're going to do the same thing, but this time we're adding this right here. I think, yeah, this goes this way. like this. Okay, so that's step number one. Okay, so for the next part, you're just gonna flip it on its side where the basket and stuff, like the bottom part of this. And then we're gonna take this one right here. Again, keep all these aligned, going the same way. And then it's going to go right here. So you're going to grab this and you're going to screw it into the bottom of this. So you're going to push this through right here. And then you're going to screw it slightly. And I'll finish it up with a drill. Okay, so for the next part, you're going to want to get this right and you here. You want to slightly, I like to slightly screw it in with my hand first. And then I like to get the wrench to finish. So you're just gonna screw on the wheels on all four of the ends, the other ends over here. And then after I'm done with that, I'll show you what to do next. Just make sure you're tightening it the very end piece with this to make sure that they're not gonna come off. Like that. And then let me go ahead and do the rest and I'll show you what's next. Okay, and now you're gonna get the cues and we're gonna start adding all these other baskets. So we're gonna start off with this one right here and you're just gonna push it through. Um, make sure that the basket is on the side um, where it has this little one because I had the basket on the opposite side so I had to take it apart and redo it. Um, I didn't realize that I put it on the wrong. So just wanna push this through and then I'm just gonna tighten it on this side. And then what I like to do, it did come with this little bolt thing right here. So let me go ahead and do both sides. So I grab this. I put it on the other side of the bolt. Just kind of hold it. And I grab this and go on this side to just tighten everything up. And then I'm going to do the same thing. It says this one right here. We're going to put these bars, but it's going to go like on the inward part right here. And it's going to be the J's again. Okay, so this time for this one, we're going to push the screw through. Just like that. We're going to put this on from the inside because it has these little holes right here. And then, and then we're going to put this part on right here the bolt part on to make it tight and screw it on okay and then we're going to do that same thing <clears throat> i'm going to add this bar to this side and then put the bolts on this side as well and then once i'm done with this piece i'll show you what's next okay so you don't want to um attach this to this wall yet because we're going to be putting a bolt and it's gonna go actually through these racks. So the next part is gonna be this rack up here. It's gonna be right here. 
we're going to do the Q. Okay, so for this top part, we're going to take this, put the bolt through here, push it through here, grab this, push it through here, then grab the little lug nut and we're going to put that on the back. Tighten it up as much as we can. Let me go ahead and get that other side done so that it'll just be easier. And we're going to take this, of course, on the back side. Make sure it's nice and tight. And so we're done with that side. And then the next part is going to be these middle racks. And we're going to take the bigger screws like this. So there's going to be, it's hard because there's no room. So you're going to do a rack in the back and a rack in the front. So you're just going to push it this part through right here. Kind of get it going. And then I believe when it gets to the other side, we're going to be adding another rack thing, which I'm going to show you how to do that in a second. Let me go ahead and tighten these and then put this side on, but I'm not going to put the bolts at the very end yet. I'll show you what to do. Okay, so I screwed on these two bottom ones and then we have two more left. So I'm going to go ahead and put these ones on and I'm going to do the same thing. But on these ones, since we got these in, I'm going to put that on over it. So again, this time I'm going to go through this loop, push it through. We're gonna go through this side right here. And then I'm gonna do the same thing to this rack on this side. Okay, so next you're gonna see these little holes right here. And you're gonna get these. So I'm gonna start it down here. And I'm going to put a bolt right through here. And then we're going to push it through this hole and it's going to go inside this gate right here. So let me try to stabilize it. So this one actually goes on the back. So this one does not go right there. It actually goes where I just plugged in that one. So let me go ahead and take this bolt out and then I'll re-put this together. Okay, and now once you're done with that, you're going to take this big bar and it's actually going to go in right here. So you're going to take this bolt, push it in here, in here, drive it through. We're going to take it go like that. Go ahead and tighten it in. Okay, and then we're going to do that to this other side as well. And so now I'm just going to take these two bolts and I'm going to drive them into these and then I'll show you what to do after I'm done with this part. Okay, and after we're done with that, you have this other long one and you're going to want it to put it like where this curve is. All right, let me make sure. Yes, yeah, so it's going to go right here. Okay, and now when you're done with that, we're going to put these little pieces right here. So I already put that metal bar in the middle. Okay, and I'm going to do the same thing to this side, getting this bar and putting it this way. And then I'll show you what to do next. And then after you're done with that, you're going to take this apart. And it says you're going to wrap this around like this and then you're going to velcro it right here and the same thing with this side you wrap it around and velcro it right there and then you have this one right here and you're going to do the same thing wrap this around right here and velcro it right there Into this side just like that and then it shows M pieces which are these right here and it says like on this side you're gonna put it 
right here, just like that. So you just kind of latch them over. I actually forgot to screw over here, so let me go ahead and screw this in. Just like that, and then these two right here. Where these two dots are. So you can do just like that. And then you are done. So that's what it looks like. Of course, this is the back side. Let me go ahead and turn it around and show you what it looks like. Okay, so that is what the completed product looks like. See, this is that bar that I put on so it'll keep anything from falling out. Very nice and it has little baskets on the side, little hooks. I love it, I love it, love it, love it. But yeah, that completes this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, God bless.